Welcome to Homes Gymnastics, I'm Plamen and you're with my gym based channel. I'll help you develop your strength, better range of motion and control of your body in a safe progressive way with gymnastics moves, exercises and games. The focus will be on bodyweight exercises performed in a home environment just by yourself or with a partner with little to no equipment required. Let's get started. Today's lesson is going to be gymnastics balances, basic gymnastics balances. The first balance that I'm going to start with is one leg balance with knee, uh, with tucked leg. The balance looks like this. Arms are going to be out to the side, one knee is going to be up, toes pointed. Head neutral, looking forwards, just like that. That's it. And that is what it looks from the front. Some of the common mistakes that kids and gymnasts tend to do is to tuck their heel under the bottom and leave the knee down. Arms sometimes are down here instead of up here. So what we're looking to correct is to lift the knee up, get the toes pointed, arms to be out of the side. Also bottom leg, also bottom leg must be straight, not bent, not here, that is wrong. Straight leg, knee up, pointed toes, arms out to the side, nice and straight, shoulder height, chin up, head in a neutral position. That's how it looks and it is exactly the same with the other leg. Knee up, toes pointed, arms out to the side, shoulders up, arm shoulder height, straight hands, head up. Okay, so that's what the first uh, balance should look like. The next balance that I'm going to go through, one leg balance, straight leg to the front, pointed toes, arms out, bottom leg straight and same uh, rule applies here as for the previous one. Head has to be pointed forward, uh, head has to be in a neutral position looking forwards, toes pointed, legs straight and let's go down have a little rest. The next balance is going to be again one leg balance with the other leg straight pointed out to the side, arms are going to be out, knee pointed up and toes pointed. Ooh. Okay, maybe you're going to be able to hold it for a little bit longer. Let's try it again. Arms out, shoulders up, straight arms, knee pointed up to the side and leg up straight. Like this. Okay, common mistakes. Bent, leg is bent, toes are not pointed, or knee, most of the time, what you will see as a mistake in that balance is knee to be pointed forwards rather than up. So we need to correct that by getting this knee pointed up to the ceiling. And the next balance, left leg down on the floor, nice and straight. The right leg is going to be pointed uh, backwards, toes pointed, arms out. So this is going to be our fourth balance or the third one from the sequence with the straight leg balance. Okay, common mistakes again, toe, uh, back leg is not straight or the toes are not pointed. Where we're looking for pointed toes, straight leg, arms out to the side and head in a neutral position, chin up, arms out straight. Okay. The next balance that I'm going to show is the tiptoe balance. So, as the name suggests, you just need to go onto your tiptoes. Again, we're going to be looking for shoulders up, head neutral, legs together, and you're going to go onto your tiptoes. You can have it with your arms down by your sides, arms up to the sides, or arms up by your ears like this. So, tiptoes, arms up, nice straight arms and head in a neutral position. Okay, that's how it looks at the front. Feet together, toes together, shoulders up, head in a neutral position and arms up by your sides 
I'm sure that you cannot see my arms from there. The camera is not going to be able to catch that. So I'm just going to squat down for the purposes of the video so you can see my arms the way that I have positioned my arms. So arms are straight, up by my ears, head into a neutral position and that is it. The next balance is going to be an arabesque. For the arabesque you need to go with legs together. You're going to put one leg forward, you're going to transfer your body weight onto, your, onto the leg that is at the front and you're going to have the other leg nice and straight, pointed towards the back, arms straight and you're going to start leaning forwards. So you're going to lean, 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 you're going to have arms straight as I said earlier, shoulders, squeeze your shoulders back, squeeze your bottoms and back leg straight, nice pointed toes and look forwards. Okay. The common mistakes that you can see into that balance is having the leg, the supporting leg, being bent, which we don't want that to happen. So you have this leg must be straight, back leg also needs to be straight, toes have to be pointed on your back leg. You're looking for a nice straight line starting from the back leg all the way up to the shoulder. Now I'm going to give you one very important tip to make it easier for yourself. You just need to focus when you're holding the arabesque at a point in front of you to make it easier for balancing. Okay, so that was today's lesson. I hope you enjoyed it. And now, if you want to challenge yourself, you can make uh, a conditioning out of the balances that we've just learned. You have the one leg balance with a straight leg in front of you with a straight leg to the side and with a straight leg to the back. So what we're gonna do now is try, get the arms out and do leg swings going to, uh, to the front for the count of 20. So we're gonna do one, two, three, four, five and so on until we get to 20. After we get to 20 with the same leg, we're gonna go out to the side and we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, and then we're gonna go to the back. So, point to toes, arms out, shoulders up, head in a neutral position, and one, two, three, four, five, and so on until we get to 20. So once you're done with the right leg or with the left leg, whichever leg you start first with, you're gonna go with the other leg and you're gonna do exactly the same thing for the same, uh, with the same repetitions and that is it now you have learned the some of the basic balances that we have in gymnastics and you have an amazing conditioning that you can do in the morning that is gonna focus on your core muscles and on your glutes thanks a lot for watching and if you enjoy the lesson please subscribe to my channel like and comment below thank you see you in the next one